Ugh. I've been doing comedy for about, uh, I've been doing comedy for about seven years now. Did you guys get a shot of my bike? Ugh. It's a Schwinn quality. You missed it, you missed it earlier. I was doing jumps over, I was doing jumps over barrels over there. The good bike. Gotta hold on to this bike. Yeah, you saw me, you know, I'm just out here working on my bike, working on my tricks, you know, doing races. It's about 106 degrees out here. Seems like, uh, oh, we got some races going on here. Races. Hey, what's up, man? I stop cars sometimes and I ask them if they want to do a joke. Look at that thing, that thing's a beast. That thing's a beast. <laughs> that thing's a beast, hey. I've been doing comedy for a long time, though. Um, and I love to I love to make people laugh. I love to do jokes inspired by Bill Cosby. Have you ever seen the movie uh, Kindergarten Cop? That's that's my favorite movie. Yeah, I'm a horsepower. I'm a horsepower in this thing, guys. I do comedy, and when I'm not working on my bike, that's what I'm doing, and I hope to make a profession out of it. On the count of three, we're gonna race. I went to uh, I tried to get into um, uh, Last Comic Standing. But they filed a restraining order against me, so I'm not allowed to. Tr I'm not allowed to go near Bill Bellamy. But uh. Oh! <laughs> not a lot of people want to hear my jokes tonight. Today, it's really hot out. They're just kind of speeding by with their AC on. I won the race and I beat him. I beat that guy. I told a joke about uh, um how. A beard when it gets when it gets uh, when it gets shaven, then you don't have a beard anymore. <laughs> yeah. Good, buddy. Good, buddy. Good guy. And uh, and uh, I I do comedy and I try to be the funniest I can be and I write my jokes, but I write my jokes with help from um, my partner and he's my he's my cohort and my right hand man. That's that's Pat Cackley. Ugh. So hot I had to take my shoes off. That's how hot it is, I had to take my shoes off. I think I'm getting heat stroke. I took my shoes off, I gotta do take my socks off. I'm getting heat stroke. But I do it, I do it for the fans. I do it, I'll get heat stroke for the fans. Man, what I wouldn't give for a Klondike bar right now. I should make a joke about a Klondike bar. I'm getting heat stroke. I am getting heat stroke. <coughs> yeah, I got heat stroke. I'm Pat Cackley, Shane's assistant. I love Shane. I love Shane like a brother, uh, in a Jesus way. Shane is here. Kindergarten cop is it's here. Well, maybe they're on the same axes, togetherness of, of the same. Shane's hilarious. If we ever got married, I would hyphenate my name for Shane. And uh, in the meantime, when I'm not uh, assisting Shane, I'm uh, working the arts at the Spear in a Jesus way. We once, we once talked about that we would move to Texas and have a family of, of, of truckers in a Jesus way. He's the funniest man I've ever met, and I would give up spearing. Shane. We're, we're gonna be the best that we're gonna be. I'm gonna manage him straight to the top and beyond. Yeah, um, you know, aside from all this comedy stuff, I got a, I got a girlfriend. Um, 
you know, it's a pretty steady relationship that I'm that I'm currently in. I have a love life, a, so a very solid love life. It's a distance, really. That's it, we're separated by distance. She lives in Oregon, but uh, you know, I'm trying. I want to meet her one day. I send her messages. I send her emails. I send her messages. I like that. I'm gonna send her one right now. So I get to look at um, her. She's a supermodel. Her name's Theresa, and you know, this is like her bottom half. Um, I haven't really met her, so it's kind of weird, but I love her. And she's got a really good tattoo here, a, a tattoo there, that um, it kind of sa it says, um, I forgot what it means. Damn, it's Japanese for the word hustle, hustler, but, or something like that, something Asian. <laughs> I don't know, I don't know. Hey, oh. there's my uh, funny, funny guy man what? right there. Where's my, uh, where's the statue? This, this right? Yeah. Um, fell off the back of the car. What do you mean, dude? It's I need... Capitated. It's... I, I needed that statue. I told you to go to, go to the nursery and get the statue, because I wanted to put it in the front lawn. You, you, you're, you're the man. You're the funny guy. Just, you're just the man next the time, brain. next time, just be a little more quiet when you come in. At least lie to me and say you had the statue. That was a big thing, man. I needed you to pick that up for me, dude. All right. And you didn't bring the chocolate milk. You drink it on the way here? Drink the chalk chalk. You know I need that? Lubricate the pipes. You, know, you got to keep these boys ripe. Selfish. Selfish. It's all right. I really needed that statue, though. Really needed that statue. That was really what I was banking on today. It was going to make my day. Sit Indian That's, style. Yeah, because this is Indian style. But is that racist? No, it's just that, Indian. That might, it's how Indian might, sat. Indian our, sat like this. Indian, this is how Indian Indonesians sat. Fans. Is that the shot? You see, it? this is how Indian sat. The show tonight. The show tonight's going to be awesome. Uh, packed house. I think uh, all, all five seats that we've set out have uh, been filled. They said they'll come if they're not bowling. And we always save one seat for Bill Cosby because we always invite <laughs> we invite, Billy. We always invite Bill. I love Cosby. Bill Cosby. That's like Will. That's genuine Will Cosby right there. That's that's Big Willie style. This is more like William. Like, oh, get ready, cause I'm gonna um, I'm gonna you know, do a funny joke here at the golf course. At the golf course. I mean, it's just tonight we're trying to really bring out. You know, we got we got we got a time slot. We're going in. We're going hard. This is the big show, actually. For me, this is the one. I'm gonna let out all the material we've been working on that we've been working on, collaborating, we're gonna bring it out. We're gonna bring, we're not pulling any Unleash punches. the beast. We're gonna unleash the demon. You gotta cuss a little bit more. Yes. Maybe cut, like say, ass. Cause this is bullshit, cause I thought we had one written. I thought we had a joke about the teens, the teens of our generation written. Uh, and it, it's funny because the, that Energizer Bunny, he's just supposed to just keep going. And then, the, but, but, but then he, we throw him a curve. <laughs> God, you, God, that's a that good was, one. That's, that a good one. You... that's fresh. I'm gonna put a music note next to it. Okay, yeah, that um, makes sense. Uh, let's see. We don't wanna, cause we want people to know, like, oh, he's current, he's fresh, he's in the loop. He he knows he's making a joke about Lindsay Lohan. He's gonna go out there and be hot and spicy like buffalo wings on your tongue. 